I'm Taylor Reese. I'm the Junior Guard Coordinator for Athlon Bay. Uh, ninth year lifeguard as well. Flag is a fun game. When we teach to our kids, we tell them that it is about having a quick pop up from being relaxed and mellow, like lifeguards are, what we say 95% of the time, and then switching immediately to I gotta find someone who's drowning and save their lives. So, with flags on the beach and water flags, that's, that's what the idea behind it is going from relaxed to super alert. I'm Kendall and I'm in the B group for Jamaica. I'm Abby and I'm in the C Jellies group of Half Moon Bay Junior Lifeguards. I'm Alex Dong and I'm in the group B with the Sand Bears. I played the 9. I got 6. I got 10. Most people put their elbows out. I like to keep my elbows in for some reason. I don't know why. But. I just kind of ran as fast as I could and hoped for the best. I like to get, get a good start and cut them off, kind of, so then they don't get a fly. It would be a little boring if people weren't that competitive that they were trying to like, elbow people and stuff. But sometimes it gets a little crazy, like towards the end especially. The Capitola in Santa Cruz, I don't know about the other ones, but they um, are pretty fierce about making sure they win every competition, so they're like the rivals and we just like come here as a small team to just have fun, I guess. We focus on the lifeguarding and self-rescue aspects as opposed to competition or land-based activities. I've been doing it for five years and every year has been really fun, so I like to come back to do that first. As a small program, sometimes it's pretty tough for the kids. <clears throat> we don't usually get as many points as like Capitola with a thousand fifty points or so. Um, I think we always try and represent. We had a good day today because everybody left with a smile. And whether we won or not, we didn't win. Everybody left super stoked. And for me, whoever has the most fun wins.